Hey there, Elliot here. Have you ever been stuck with an iPhone showing the lock to owner message, also known as the iCloud activation lock? Well, you're not alone. It's like the digital equivalent of having gum stuck to your shoe. It's sticky, annoying, and not what you signed up for. Many services, software, and quick fix methods promise to eliminate this problem. But let me tell you something, not all are safe or legal. But don't worry, we've got your back. This video will show you several legal, safe, and free ways to remove the locked to owner message on your iPhone, iPad, or Apple Watch. These methods are not only quicker, but guaranteed to work. So forget about those fancy software programs, and let's get that iPhone running smoothly together, shall we? Before we jump into it, just a quick note. This information is only for those who own their device, but have forgotten their access details. We're not here to help with stolen devices or any illegal activity. So let's play fair and respect the law and YouTube's rules, okay? Now let, let's explore some helpful services. Let's say you've come across Locked to Owner. This web app offers solutions for those iPhone Locked to Owner issues. It has a pretty intuitive interface and some brilliant features. But hold on, it's not the only player in the game. We've got the iUnlock app. It's another great tool to consider, especially if you want something straightforward and user-friendly. Another one on the list is Safe Unlocks. They've built a solid reputation for caring for those iCloud activation locks. What's cool about Safe Unlocks is how they simplify the process, making it almost effortless. And let's remember, Unlock here is an AI-powered unlocking web app. This stellar tool combines artificial intelligence with a clear-cut interface to help you resolve your lock issues. It's like having a tech wizard right at your fingertips. Remember, it's all about providing you with options so you can figure out what suits you best. In our next step, we'll guide you through using Unlock Here's AI Unlocking Assistant. So stay tuned for that. Trust me, you'll want to stick around. Now there's something important you should know. These unlock services work primarily in first world countries. So if you're in a region where you can't access these services or don't want to use them, we've got an alternative for you. We offer 250 unlocks every week for our viewers. Yes, you heard that right, every week. What do you need to do to enter? Simply like this video, hit that subscribe button, leave a comment with your device model like Samsung S9, IMEI, and country. Once you've done these, you're automatically entered in the draw. It's as simple as that. Let's kick things off by heading over to unlockhere.com on your phone or computer browser. This nifty web app powered by an AI assistant can unlock any mobile phone restriction. Once on the site, you'll meet Nifty, the AI bot. Let Nifty know that you need an iCloud to unlock by clicking on Activation Lock. You then have to select the device type. In this case, it's an iPhone, but you could also choose an iPad or Apple Watch if that's what you're using. The next step is to enter your device's IMEI or serial number. If you're using an iPhone, it will have an IMEI. Some iPads and Apple Watches also have IMEIs if they have a SIM card slot or cellular capacity. However, most of them don't. In that case, you'll need to enter the serial number instead. Where can I find this information? Here's how. Press the sleep button twice with your locked device and tap the eye icon at the bottom right. Your device information will now appear. Remember to input this device information in the next step. This is crucial. Afterward, you must enter basic info to link the order to your account. Make sure to use accurate information to receive your order confirmation. Yeah, you will receive a confirmation code sent to your email. Once you've done that, agree to the terms and confirm that you're not trying to unlock a stolen device. Complete the quick captcha to prove you're not a robot and then tap start process. Now, head over to your email inbox where you'll find an email with a confirmation code. Check your spam or junk folder too if it ends up there. Grab the confirmation code from the email and hop back to the Unlock Here website. Enter it there, prove you're not a robot again, and voila! Your unlock process has started and your device will soon be opened. As you can see here, we swipe up to see the iPhone locked to owner page. In this part, it really takes time and patience. We wait for the unlock process to activate the phone. And as you can see, we swipe left and wait for a few minutes to activate your iPhone. Don't worry, it will be worth the wait. You will enjoy your phone once again, once it's finally unlocked. So it may take a few minutes to activate your iPhone. Patience is the key here. And there it is. In this part, let's skip all the setup. Don't worry, you can go back to set it all up later. Make sure to check the terms and conditions and skip the rest of the steps 
and just do it all later on. And there you have it. It says, welcome to iPhone. Now, go to settings and create your own Apple ID. Tap forget password or don't have Apple ID to create a new one. And here you can just add your personal details to continue. And here's a shortcut to check your device info, making sure that this is legit. And yeah, your device is now fully unlocked and ready to use. So there you go. But hey, if this method doesn't tickle your fancy, don't worry, another one is coming up. All right, guys, it's time to explore more legal ways to remove that iPhone locked to owner or iCloud activation lock. Here are some alternative ways to eliminate that iCloud activation lock without venturing into gray areas. Instead of wrestling with shifty online tools or sketchy websites, we'll stick to the straight and narrow, using legal methods to keep you on the right side of the tracks. First things first, if you've bought the iPhone secondhand, the easiest way to unlock it is to contact the previous owner and ask them to remove the device from their iCloud account. I mean, it sounds obvious, right? But sometimes, the most straightforward solutions fly right under our radar. Now, you can reach out to Apple if the previous owner is unavailable, or you're the original owner who's just forgotten your iCloud details. The Apple support team is super helpful. You'll likely need proof of purchase or other identifying information to prove that you're not trying to unlock someone else's iPhone. But once you convince them, they can assist you with removing the activation lock. Another handy way to remove the iCloud activation lock is through Apple's Find My App. Here's a quick walkthrough. 1. Open the Find My App on another Apple device. 2. Sign in with your Apple ID. 3. Tap on the Devices tab. 4. Select the device you want to remove. 5. Swipe up on the device details and tap Remove This Device. Remember, the activation lock is there for a good reason. It's designed to protect your device and personal data. So, permanently remove the lock before passing on your device, or turn on the activation lock only after setting up your new device. Remember that these methods might take time and patience, so buckle up. And that's it. Stay tuned for more tips and tricks coming up in the next videos.